Welcome to the cast iron Lebanese cooking and more. Hello, my Dutch oven lovers. If you never cook in Dutch oven, hope you will be one soon. My dish to you today is continuous to previous dish I made with the flat beans. Beans with oil is a veggie dish. Uh, three videos before was on vegetable stew. One with the green beans, one with okra beans. Today my dish to you is an eggplant with oil. This is a very popular dish and usually uh, you can cook it before, same like other veggie. You have them in the refrigerator, you take them with, with you next day if you're going camping or going to work and you just eat it cold. You can eat it hot, but it doesn't go delicious like when it is cold. Let me show you my ingredients. I have here one pound of eggplant. They are a small size like these. I'll show you how we prepare them. One pound. These are eggplants from my garden. I have here two medium size uh, onion cut long way, julian. I have one pound tomato chopped. I have garbanzo beans. It's a one can, 15 ounce, but I might use only for the one pound, I will use half of it. If I'm doing two pound plant, then I can use the whole can. This is most of the Lebanese they put the garbanzo with it. Some they don't. And I have here one whole of the garlic also cut long way. Seasoning, I have one small tablespoon salt and half, uh, sorry, half, uh, one teaspoon salt, half teaspoon black pepper. One quarter of quarter cup of extra virgin olive oil and I have one tablespoon tomato paste with a one, one cup of water in case I need to make the sauce a little more thicker. Optional, some they use it, some they don't, one potato chopped, small pieces. The eggplant, I cut the head discard these this is another one take it out and then I peel strips this is small eggplant doesn't have too much uh, seeds in it and they are really soft after you cut them like this you will cut them like quarter inch to three eight cut each one like three strips these I sprinkle salt on them half an hour ago, put them in this strainer to get all the water and if there is any bitterness in it, and these are, look how much water came from these. These are ready to go right now. The garlic, to show you this one, it's all cut long, like this whole. I just, it, it is small. I just cut it into two pieces strip. It's a one whole garlic. Now what we want to do, we want to start saute a little bit the eggplant first. Let me light using a 12 inch Dutch oven. Okay, one quarter cup extra virgin olive oil. Then we'll have the eggplant.
we want to get them a little bit browny. Now I want to take them out, put them here. If there is any excess oil, can go. We leave them on the side. Now we want to start with saute the onion. Now the onion is softened. We want to add the garlic. Around two minutes more. Now we want to add the tomato. Add the tomato paste. We want to add the potato. Add right now half the cup of the water. If I need, I add more. Look like I need to add all the water here. Add half the garbanzo. And then put back the eggplant. Seasoning is only salt and pepper. And if you like paprika or little chili powder, you can add too. We want to cover the oven. Coals are already hot. I want to put 10 at the bottom. One on the center. And get my Dutch oven. Cooking time about one hour or 50 minutes. I think this will be done. Mm -hmm. 50 minutes and I'll get back to you. I want it to rest for five minutes. Okay, it has been five minutes. We want it to rest. This is what it is. Called, this in Lebanese called them sa'a, means cold. Put the eggplant. Any kind of eggplant is fine. And this will be served with pita bread, cucumber, radish, olives, as you like. Hope you enjoyed this dish. It's a eggplant with oil, veggie dish, and it has to be eaten cold. It can stay in your refrigerator for three, four days. And... Uh, I'm looking forward for the next one will be also okra with oil. One time I do veggie, then I do stew. In between, I will do 
the dessert. I did also baklava dessert, another kind of baklava. And after the okra, I want to do again another kind of baklava dessert. Hope you enjoy my dish and look for my other uh, dishes on my channel. Please do not forget to subscribe and share and give me your comments. See you next time. Bye.